Uh, I want to take you through a quick workflow of looking at the model compare with a non-collaboration for Revit model using BIM 316. So this is my uh, local model. It's not set up inside of collaboration for Revit. It does have a linked local structural file here. I just want to be using the uh, architectural model here and do a model comparison using the feature inside of BIM 360 team. So the quick example I want to use is just to throw in a, a few random uh, windows and uh, delete a few of these items here and then just uh, save the model. So I'm just going to close that out and just save it. And what I want to do now with that local model is bring it into the BIM 360 team environment to do model comparison. So you can do this two ways. You can actually upload a new version or you can drag and drop it from your Explorer here. So I'm just going to do the drag and drop. It has to be the same name and then inside of BIM 360 team it will recognize the same name and it will move from version 1 to version 2. So I'm just going to uh, drag and drop that in and it's just going through the conversion process. So now we have the model here and it's gone from V2 to V3. So if we go to view that model and it's just going to do the conversion And now we have the newer model here with the edit windows. So if you've got a really complex model and you need to see those changes and you want the BIM 360 team tool to actually check those changes automatically for you so you don't miss anything, here's where you can use the model comparison tool. So go compare versions. And we're just gonna do this in the 3D environment. And what it's done is it's gone through the model and identified that I've added five new windows, removed three items, and those are the chairs there, highlighted in red, and two bits of uh, parametric geometry, being the two walls, have been modified. You can select through the uh, breakdown of the um, object hierarchy here to identify them. And if you uh, either manually select them or select them in the uh, hierarchy here, you can look at what's changed between version two and version three. So if I just spin around, and let's say this is a really complex project, we can go back to version two, where there were no windows. Version two, there were no windows. Version three, three windows have been added. So again, a really powerful tool to help with your comparison between authoring versions. I'm doing this by just drag and dropping Revit models with the same name into BIM 360 team. I don't need to use collaboration for Revit to access this feature. It's all via team. So uh, please check it out. It will read 100 different file formats. You can upload all these files, view them on the cloud, and then start to benefit from some of these powerful features like the model comparison feature.